Yes guys, welcome back to the channel and today's vlog Well, it's starting off about travelling We're already here We're at Swiss Cottage, as you can see in the background In London uh, This is just a brief stop off point uh, And then we're going into London We're going to Hyde Park Meeting up with a few different people And we'll be vlogging today uh, As well as filming several other videos um, Obviously it's St George's Day today So I'll be filming that you're not even on camera, I'm on camera. <laughs> this, is, yes. this is doing it the wrong way. I know, I'm winding you up. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, I'm with Audit in Yorkshire and um, West Audit Reports, who's just gone for a little fiddle. I just nearly whacked her in the face. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go see what London's all about today, along with do, filming other videos um, and seeing what's popping in London on St George's Day. Let's go. London Underground. Oh. Yeah, we're caught up with him. Get in the tube. Let's go. So we're off and we're ascending. Uh, where are we? Green Park. Green Park. We're at Green Park now, guys. Anyway, so we just had a prick on the stairs. He's got it all on camera. Um, <laughs> but we're off on the way out now. <laughs> but the one thing you don't get used to when you come to London and you travel around London is the smell of the underground. Just a, smell, just a certain smell yes guys welcome back to the channel and today we are in london we've got audit in yorkshire we've got west audit reports and we've just come across this japanese embassy so we're gonna go take a look see what this is all about and uh yeah see what happens here Interesting. We've got the security gates there. What are you talking about? Oh, we love a, we love a sign like that. What's that, sir? No photos and video. No photos and video. No food and drink. For security reasons, ID checks in progress, and then we've got. Japanese writing. Which is obviously everything explained that's in yeah, English, yeah, in Japanese. Yeah, that's pretty cool, that. What's that, total security, is it? I don't know. Is it total? Might be. Total security. But they're advertising something in the back. Entry to the embassy for any other purpose, but it's intended for, um, including uh, pre-arranged appointments, is strictly prohibited. So we've got two guards looking out now. One of them's on radio. And the other one's... Oh, that's what they're advertising in there. Look, you're on Japanese soil, mate. Magna, they're advertising this. Free entry. Hi. Hiya. So, Hello, right. you alright? Sorry, I'm just reading. Soil. I'm just reading this. Yeah, I'm reading this a sec, sorry, you've got it you've got it here so it's kind of an obtuse angle. I tried reading that sign, but I'm just reading this. Give me one second, mate. I'll try to work out what security company you're with. Total security. Sorry. I see it's not TLS. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's the security company. Yeah, so we're going to go and have a look at the security company. I see a lot about around London. Well, I was just trying to read because I was trying to read the one inside, but. Um, so, yeah, but which uh, like YouTube channel or something you're representing? Say that again. Which YouTube channel or something you are? Ah, you be, you played the game before, haven't you? <laughs> have you? Have you had many people coming here filming? Uh, not, not really. Not really. One sword by sense. Right. Okay. No, it's just obviously it's an interesting place, isn't it? It's the um, em embassy of Japan. Yeah. There's a lot of embassies and consulates in uh, London. I don't normally film them. Mostly like the international waters and everything kind of things. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a beautiful chandelier. I don't normally film them. My friend films them a lot, but I'm just in London for there. It is a beautiful chandelier. So, so, if I can ask? Maybe any, no, no, we, we just, we just um, reporters. Okay. So, so we, we just film for matters of public interest. Like which channel YouTube? or something? YouTube. 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 Yeah. It's fine. Like yeah. me names. No, I'm not YouTube. Are you? Are you YouTube? I'm YouTube. He's YouTube. Okay. But I never tell anybody my name. You'll have to find the video. Okay, like your channel name or something? I don't give names out. Okay. 
You'll have to find it. It's nice to see you showing your SIA license. Anyway, a lot of guys don't do that on the days, but obviously you know you know the SIA rules and regulations and stuff about having it on display. And what a lot of it's people do is have it the other way around. You have it flipped yeah, so you can't you can only see the back of it. That's against regulations as yeah. well. But a lot of people don't know that. So it's just little things like that we look for and then we obviously educate people on the um, about your roots and You've played the game before, you know what's going on there. Yeah. We try not to cause too much <laughs> trouble. <laughs> alright, well, thank you for being alright with us. Alright, thank you. Alright, cheers, mate. Yeah, we'll let you go. We'll, um, we'll move on. We'll Wait, so, so you're saying to me, technically, I filmed in Japan by being yeah. on Japanese soil, stood there? Yeah, yeah, it's part of the UK, but this is basically. It's because of Japanese soil. Yeah, yeah, it is, yeah. Yeah, because it's a Japanese embassy. And just. There we go guys, switching countries so quick, you won't believe it, would you? Well, there we are, the boys walking through London. Just walked from Z-Stabbing Central, Hyde Park. Walking through here now. Just horse shit everywhere. Oh, as we're walking down, look. There's tourists down here. Shitload of tourists. <coughs> So we ain't gonna get we ain't gonna get in trouble for having cameras, are we? Definitely not. <laughs> when there's shitload of tourists. Fucking, is this fucking Palace? What do you think? Is it? I've never seen it. You've never seen it, not even on a photo. My viewers are gonna think I'm stupid now. Remember, not out of film, not stopping it. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, we'll walk around. Touristy, touristy. I didn't know. On site. Buckingham Palace. Armed guards. We've got armed guards and all that jazz. We've got vloggers. We've got more vloggers. More vloggers than you could count. Do, do, do. More vloggers than you could count with a... Nice. Excuse me, sir. Sit key in his back turning. <laughs> <laughs> They've even got a little guard post up front, so that's the room. Right. Ooh, very busy, very busy indeed. And uh, typical rainy weather of Britain. It's pissing it down. It's pissing it down. So, yeah, filming uh, more than what I normally film when I come to London in rainy, wet London. Um, yeah, just filming a bit more for the vlog for you guys. Like I said, I took a couple pictures as well, they'll be on my Instagram, make sure you go over to my Instagram, follow me on Instagram. Um, but yeah, I'm going to film as much as I can whilst I'm here. Um, oh, they have got a parade on, let's capture this. I'm not sure what this place is, do you know what this place is, Yeah, it's We've got some soldiers on a little march or something here. Proper touristy yeah, this is. Museum. Guards Museum. Give us a tune. Fire engine. Yeah, this is about four or five different types of guards. So here we are just approaching Big Ben, which is actually just the name of the bell, it's not the clock tower. You've got police literally everywhere, look at that. 
Waterloo's on south side. Literally we've got more police in this quadrant than anywhere else. Yeah, yeah, so we've got a... Uh, got TV presenters here. Bit of TV going on. He's had to whack his umbrella out because he's scared at rain, scared at water. TMZ. Filming there. Coppers everywhere. That's who people from sitting on the grass. That's So what I, what what I generally find about London is police generally just leave you alone and leave you to it. A majority of the time anyway. Majority of the time just, just let you film, it's great. As you're walking by, the sound of that big bed is just a... I feel like it's New Year's Eve. <laughs> the sound of it is just... It's nice, isn't it? It's English, isn't it? But yeah, it's English. English. sound like that. What's the time when it has to be repaired? Sort of you know what the sound like. comes uh, in with price. So you get to go on your bus, your open top bus and you get to go on your little cruise ship. Wow. They didn't want us because they didn't want to put 12 people in for nearly an hour so we're going right across the road to five guys so let's go to five guys so what's that what's that i've heard i've heard you haven't had five guys before no you've never had five guys no i don't want to start now either well right now you're having five guys <laughs> so guys the vlog is pretty much coming to the end of day one um We've walked around London. Uh, there's still gonna be a few clips I'm gonna be filming later that I'll probably put in before. But right now, we're just filming a couple of last minute videos, last minute audits. Um, one at the Duchess Bank across the road just there, um, which you might have seen on my main channel. Um, yeah. It's filming, having fun, you know how it is. Um, yeah, make sure you like, make sure you subscribe, all that good stuff. And we'll, uh, we'll see what else I get up to this evening. I don't, I don't know. I don't know what's happening. Everywhere you look, it's all like LED lights and stuff. It's all buildings. It's crazy. Hello, guys. Morning. He's already raving. Um, we've got war with us as well. Uh, we've had to. We've had DJ leave us. How many people out there can say that they've. Cut it up to deep. <laughs> oh, sorry. How many how many how many people out there can say that they've cuddled up to DJ in bed? 
not better. I did. I feel privileged. You did? Yeah, I did. I did. Me and DJ in a double bed together. With, uh, I think we had a rainbow blanket as well, to be fair. Yeah, that rainbow blanket. Oh man, it gets It was sweet, everywhere. wasn't it? It was comfortable, comfortable. wasn't it? Comfortable. But look at that drop, guys. That is a mad drop. Go for a ride. But yeah, um, morning time. Oh, where's my card? I'll, I'll pick it back up in a sec, guys. Hello, guys. Anyway, we, um, we, do, we don't know where we're going, so we're coming up and down this massive escalator. Um, but yeah. Oh, yeah. But basically, we, we, stay, we stayed overnight in... Um, thanks to Scorpion Audits. Yep. So make sure you go check him out. Um, it's got some brilliant content on there. We was watching a couple last night, to be fair. Yeah. Um, yeah. But yeah. With the guys. We, we're we're just chilling. This is obviously in the morning. I need the coffee, man. We need to Costa. I need coffee. It's got to be a Costa coffee. Yet, guys. I know, we need to wake Don't up. Don't forget to subscribe to Yorkshire Paranormal on YouTube. You might want to see yourselves on YouTube. Yeah, I'm going to be scouring YouTube work to see if you can find yourself. Say hi, you guys. Hello. Okay. No one wants to say hi to you guys. Sorry. Well, we're gonna we're gonna do a little a little uh, review, aren't we? Morning coffee. Yeah. Oh shit. <laughs> we're gonna. Oh, sorry. Um, we're gonna do a little morning review, morning coffee. Uh, Where's it called? Red Star Box Cafe outside of Swiss Cottage Station. Right. We're gonna do a little coffee review. Bearing in mind, me and Ay, we like his coffee in the morning. Yeah, we do. I know I drink any drinks as well, but I like my coffee in the morning. And we've not had one yet, and we've been up for a few hours now. Yeah, normally that's the first thing we do before we leave house. We've come all the way from um, the Chadwell Heath. Chadwell Heath, all the way back to Swiss Cottage. To try this coffee. And as you can see, guys, this is a little independent um, cafe slash coffee house. And we were going to go to Subway or Costa or something like that, but I'd much rather support a small, small business. businesses like this. Yeah. Because they need the money, these big companies don't. Not saying there's all wrong with it. Again, again, I have said this before on this channel. Make sure you do support your small businesses. Um, small businesses yeah. is what's going to make this country thrive again. Um, yeah, support your small businesses over the big corporations. I, I have said that several times before. Um, but yeah, we're going to try this coffee out. See what it's like. Uh, is it one? Thank you. That's the first coffee. So here's his first coffee. Check that out. That's what it looks like. Let's give it a taste test. Alcohol. Alcohol. Absolutely gorgeous that mate. And I like I live on Costa and that is gorgeous. It's hot, it's smooth, it's creamy. Oh my god, that is nice. And then three. Oh yeah, as far as coffees go guys, that's a that, that is a nine in my book yeah oh i can't wait to get hold of mine now that is a nine that is one of the nicest coffees i've had ever can't wait old. let's get mine coffees so, uh here we go absolutely Taste outstanding test. brother you're welcome man anytime six but how much did you say three ten oh no that's right uh, is it, is it perfect to get it yeah i'm just making sure you don't charge 300 quid <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> I mean, we're the cost of living crisis, mate. <laughs> Three pound ten in anywhere in London is a sick yeah, price. Yeah, yeah. You're welcome to a red Starbucks coffee. Can I? Can I have a cup of tea? Well, tea. Do tea. Yeah. What we're doing Big up to this man. Big up to this man. This one has Amazon as well. He's got a book, the guy. What size? Uh, just a medium cup of tea. Um, milky, no sugar. Big up. And you, you have a good day. Big up to the, this man in the kiosk. Yeah, it's my book about the uh, Iranian history yeah. and about my life. I've been prison nearly 10 years. Oh, yeah. Oh, of course. I do it in Mars Zionist. What'd you go down for? Selling dodgy coffee? <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> you got to laugh about it, haven't you? You've got to laugh. If you don't laugh, you'll cry, mate. You came away from the ring. There we go. Around there. Yeah, so, okay. how's, your how's your coffee, Ryan? What, what, what do you give it out of 10, brother? Out of 10, I'm going to give it a 9 as well. I'm going to say, I'm going to say, if this place was anywhere where I normally travel, I'd be coming here every day over the over the big corporations because, yeah. like I said, it's smooth, it's hot, it's smooth, it's creamy, it's 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 it don't, it, it really is, and I'm not bigging it up. You yeah. probably think it's shut up, Kevin. It's only a coffee. <laughs> but if you're ever in uh, Swiss Cottage, guys, down in London, just come, come and get yourself a latte and give it a try for yourself. Yeah. Like I say guys, it's literally right outside the Swiss Cottage tube station and this is the area we're in. So yeah, make sure you get yourselves down here and get a coffee if you're in the local area. It's banging. It's a nice one to start. After the, after the break we've had, we've been up a couple of hours, but it's worth it to wait for this coffee to be honest. On to the next clip guys.